Why, welcome back to game, guys. Here are Kato's Corners, Coach Kato. At this point, you should know what the deal is. I'm helping you start from character creation, build up a character in the base game, to take on the Shadow of the Earth Tree expansion set. Last time I got a map fragment, this time I'm gonna get a map fragment. <coughs> Excuse me. Ah, oh, what a beautiful golden day it is here at the Altus Plateau. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. How silly of me, I almost missed a side of grace. Let me just tickle this a bit. And there we go. Don't you forget, I did not forget the golden seed. Did I get this one already? Oh, I must have gotten this one already. Oh yeah, I did get this one already. <coughs> cool. Roll for me, goats! Roll! Roll! Do the rolling. <gasps> They're rolling. They're so cute. <coughs> hmm. I often wonder... Hang on. Okay, so we actually gotta make our way about here-ish, so... Following the two. <clears throat> huh. Well then. That's a bit of a problem. Oh, hang on. Or is it? Is what a bitch would say. <clears throat> Alright. Okay. Now we're cooking. You know, I'm slightly disappointed that this isn't exactly a yellow brick road in the yellow glowy area. I'm just saying it would match. I wonder where this portal goes. Oh, hey, merchant man. What's up, buddy? Eh. Apologies, however. I must be on the way. <coughs> huh. <laughs> All right, we're gonna play a little game. Can I make, I think I can make this jump. Uh, the answer is yes. <clears throat> Barely, because I did take fall damage. Yo, those sounds. I'm gonna stay quiet for a minute, but let's just... Let's take a listen here for a minute. I'm gonna just go now. Yeah, this is kind of a spooky area because of all the, uh... Well, the spooky noises. Are they mourning? I think they're crying. Yeah, I think they're sad. I believe they're crying. Uh oh. <clears throat> oh. I pissed him off now. Wait, wait, wait. Uh. Excuse me. Okay, we just, uh. There we go, there we go. We gotta scale up the. the verticality now. Oh, that's like a windmill. Oh, is that what I think it is? Oh yeah, it's the windmill village. And I believe, yep, golden seed. Let's go. Most excellent. I'm gonna do a little status check here. I wanna, just, where's, where's my time? Oh, here we go. Not even a full 10 hours in, we're already at the Altus Plateau. Beautiful. Greetings, Malay. Even ironically, I can't finish that sentence. <clears throat> Greetings, madam. Yes. Madam sounds refined. It sounds... executive. Madam. So yes. So fellas, if you ever get the urge to say m'lady, say madam. It just sounds cooler. Now that I'm back on this road, I can now continue to make my way. By the way, I'm pretty sure I can get the Moonveil Katana at this point, which is going to be a weapon that I will be using by the uh, late to end game. But first, I gotta focus on dodging the projectiles. We must be on the move. Always be on the move. 
Okay, good. We dodged it. We dodged it. Yep, we got through. And uh, just to punk these fellas. Okay, uh, I almost got dehorsed. Let's not. I'm gonna grab this. Golden Rune 9? Swoo! <laughs> ah, yes. Another sight of grace. Ooh, flasks. Add charge to flask. Four. Yep, it takes four now. And let's talk to Molina. Uh, yes. Damn! Think about what, what Queen America told her kids. Either become a lord, a god, or be sacrificed for the, for the cause. Yeah. God, what a cunt. No, that's, that's like, that's what a cunt does. Okay, so the cool thing is now we know we need to go here. Oh, if I had gone the other direction, that would have been more straightforward. Well, I am determined. Okay, golden seed. One second. Golden seed. Just the two. Okay. And now I go this way. To get the final map fragment of the Altus Plateau area. And a couple more golden sh couple more golden seeds should also be just around that river bend. <laughs> oh fuck my cock dick. Ooh, I somehow got away with that bullshit. I forgot that this dude jumped on me. Okay, okay. Dude, dude. No! You're such a wiener. You are a wiener. Okay, more golden seeds. Also, the map fragment. Yes. And the final and the full zone is finally revealed and more of the map. Ah, we are we are getting there. Slight the side of grace. Yee. Let's see how much it is now. Still four? Four? Yeah, let's go for it. There we are. All right. So we are now at 12 flasks. So for the final two flask charges, it's going to take five golden seeds for the, la for the 13th and 14th charge. So we need 10 gold seeds for the final two flask charges. Okay, so a couple more golden seeds we can pick up right off the bat. There's one just over here. I... maybe. Or is it below me? Or is it... was I a bit off? Pretty sure it's here somewhere. Oh, maybe it's like more up top. I'm starting to think I'm going a little too far away from the beaten path. Oh, I see. I got to fight this guy. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I don't pick it up. I fight for it. Actually, I'm pretty sure this dude's resistant to sacred weapons. Alright, I got this, I got this. I got all discombobulated. I'm pretty sure. Barricade shield up. Ooh, that was a grab move. I had to dodge it. And we just keep pelking away at him. Yeah, so... Alright, there we go. Yeah, he's resistant to... Sacred damage. Dude's a little cranky. Oh! Hoo -hoo! I thought he got me there for a minute. But he didn't. Oh, 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 yes. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, well, since blocking his attacks is not consistent, I'm just gonna... Just two-hand it going from here. Ooh, 
Ooh, okay, maybe maybe I got a little overzealous. Alright. Let's keep it straightforward, because I am a little out of my league here. Uh, it would be nice if I could... Yeah. Okay, so here's the thing. I would like to do my counterattacks, please. Or at least I can just po poke at this guy. Alright, I'm just gonna go for it now. And there we go. That should be a golden seed. There we go. You defeat him around this area, and I will mark it as such. We now need to go over here for this golden seed. I will just simply... Yeah, let's go to the windmill village. We are the dancing women. We are gonna dance, and then we're gonna attack you when you least expect it, because that's how we do things at the windmill village. It's just these, like... These crazy ladies just sort of dancing in place, all over-enthusiastically smiling, and then you get too far into the village and they get enraged. And then they, their face, their face, they go from resting psycho face to resting murder face, and it's just hilarious. Oh, we'll, we'll definitely go back to the windmill village for a specific thing. Hold on, hold on. There's the golden seed. Oh, you guys are dicks. Got it. Ow. But I got the seed. Go, 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 go. I need to leave. I have to leave. Okay, we got out of there. Cool. Alright, good stuff. And seed there. I'll just go here. Alrighty then. Now, time for another sacred tier. At this church over here. Okay, so how am I gonna go about this? I'm gonna go this way to start. I prefer to stay a higher elevation for the time being. And, mm, yeah, that was the correct decision. Man, that sunset, that tree, this is just. The art direction is most. Well, golden is how I would describe it. Dude, could you imagine the tech empire that the lands between could become if everything is just all bathed in gold? I mean, gold is one of the best conductors of electricity, after all. Hello. Just picking this up. Well, okay, one second. And let me get out of this. Tickle, tickle those pickles, son. You ain't got the scrack to go against the crack. I'm just talking out. I, I'm talking out of my ass. I have no idea what I'm saying right now, but I do want to mark this. And I think it's about time. I, I'm feeling kind of cute. I just take on a, a magma worm. Sola, ha ha ha. I want to place an order for a day's double large fries and a diet coke. All right, I should probably level up. Do I even have enough? Just barely. One gold rune seven should top me off. And this dude's really ordering that. Increase amount replenished. Yep, get that. Now let's go ahead and level up here. So we got 12 intelligence. Let's get mind at 10 to round that out. Okay, this is neat. I'm feeling quite nifty about this excursion. Oh boy, it's boss fight time! 
Okay. Here's what we're gonna do. Man, this dude's really hyped me up for the boss fight. Ah! Ah! Okay, let's go. It's a magma worm! Whoops. gonna do this physic time yeah oh dicks uh, I blew my bubble the worm blew my bubble and I don't know how I feel about that I wasn't ready for him to blow my bubble this dude is just doing a shitload of area of denial throw up attacks wait for it wait for it okay if you're just gonna throw up I'm gonna do this Oh, 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 I see how the AI is functioning. Shield up, he throws up. Ooh, I'm gonna top my health off. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. I guess we can just do this. This dude is like missing so many attacks. Keep the shield up. Oh, you are such a dick tickler. Remember in Dark Souls 1 when you'd cut off the tails of your enemies to get weird weapons that you would never use anyways? Uh, 2011 was an interesting year for gaming, especially the second half, because Skyrim came out a month after Dark Souls 1. Oh, this dude's fucking... Oh, I see. Dude's fucking evolving. Dude, this worm's evolving. He's on both legs now. Oh, he's ready to go. Unfortunately, oh shit, he prepared for the double leg on Tondra maneuver. Oh my god, hitbox I'm gonna go and... S wait, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Wait. My turn, my turn, my turn, my turn. Oh, dicks, oh dicks, oh dicks. Ooh, don't get greedy, sip time. Whoop! Got him. Ha <laughs> ha! Drop the ego, don't get greedy, accomplish your dreams, and you won't be needy. <laughs> so, I actually needed to, even though I don't, I technically didn't need to do this right now, this is required for something else coming up. Okay, well, that was an excellent little excursion. All right, back to putting points into Vigor. I need to get that health pull up. Shh, wait, wait. Oh, it's just barely not enough. That is... I have to beat someone up. I'll spend them later. Do, 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 do. Okay, we're going up the elevator. Ah, oh, shit. Now the hair is going through the shield. This is getting pretty... This is getting out of control. Yeah, this is a long lift. Ah, the secret entrance to the Altus Plateau. And then from here, you can just kind of go through here, and there you go. Now, our next order of business, we're going to go this way. To... Here. We'll go back to the Summon Water Village outskirts, and we'll begin our journey from there. Hmm... Ah, oh, yes, I've already... Wait, was this the turtle? Oh, yeah, that was the turtle talisman. They were such good turtles. I'm curious, what's at this church? 
Uh oh. Is this one of those PvP encounters? Anastasia Tarnished Eater. I'm gonna light this. Alright, Anastasia. Show me your moves. Ha, <laughs> get wrecked. Woo, 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 woo. And we got the sacred scorpion charm. And a cookbook, and this other cookbook. Whoa! Now I can level up. 32 vigor, let's go. <laughs> we are looking for a super secret spoopy, ooh. Well, uh, while these graves just happen to be open, don't mind if I peruse a bit. Just gotta get, uh, here we go. Okay, next dungeon. Ooh, it's all dark and spooky. Good thing I have my hip lantern. Ho! Oh, they swiggled when they should have swoogled. Hold up, hold up. Okay, we can drop down here. And now, I can drop down here. So I already have that, don't need it. I've gotten so many summer smithing stones of the ones and the twos. Yes, made it. <gasps> made it. Okay, we should be good. Ah, uh, sight of grace. Aha. Uh -huh. Nice. 12 flask at plus nine. We're looking pretty nice. It's looking pretty good. Oh, hey. Rocks. We know what to do with rocks. We're gonna have to get these crafting materials again anyway, so we might as well pick them up. Oh, Bugle Man! Bugle Man! Bugle Man! You fucked me, Bugle Man. Well, guess I gotta fight. The. Ugh. God damn it. And I gotta fight the Krusty Boys! You fucks. Oh my lord! Okay, we're taking up Bugle Man first. Ugh, they don't stagger, that's a pain in the ass. Let's try this again. Got him. Fuck. Fuck. Alright, back to shield. All right, there you go. Wait for it. God, they just do so much damage per swing. Fortunately for myself, I got the backstab maneuver. Oh wow, that was that was a bit of a tight spot. All right, what's what's the stone? Come on, come on. Take you out. Yeah, <laughs> get wrecked. It's like a squid tentacle thing. Well. Ooh, cold pickle flower. I'll take that. Flower, flower. Yeah, f yeah, it's a, uh, oh, it's a foot something. Hang on, I got dudes on my back. I gotta get out of here. Am I even going the right, no, nope, I'm going the wrong way. Whoop, whoop, whoop. There you go. All right, I think I've circumvented them. What if I try going this way now? They're still, oh, they're hot on my trail. I think they're still hot on my trail. Yep, they're coming up, they're hot on my trail. Well, dicks. However, I'm getting some nice shiny stones. Oh, I don't want that, I want this. Ooh, got that. Ooh. 
We'll do this. You know what? I don't have time to fight this guy. I gotta get out of here. Let me just get around Diet Cthulhu here. Just... Listen, I just wanted to take your stuff and then leave. Is that too much to ask? Oh, I'm such a dick. All right, we gotta go this way. Top off my health. Eh, we can just drop down. Oh, will you hush up? Well, Bugle Man is ruining my day yet again. Light it up and take a rest. All right, how about another boss fight? That's what I'm thinking. Let's, let's do a boss fight. Just going into two-handed mode so I can get the initial burst onto the boss. Hey, look at that. It's another magma worm! Hello there. You are a magma worm. This one's actually not quite as strong as the first one I fought. So this one may not be too bad. Owie. I have been known to also bullshit from time to time. Whoops. There we go. Let's get around him. Get a couple attacky attacks. Ooh, we got hemorrhage proc. Ooh, I was way too greedy with those attacks. Alright. Ooh, blocked it. Man, this guy is just doing all the attacks. Ooh. I gotta do this. Actually, you know what? It would actually be easier if I don't lock onto him. And we just... do a little bit of two-handed action here. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Ooh, I couldn't withhold that damage. Whoops, 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 whoops. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Now we go for the strike. It's all about that patience and timing the attacks. Dragonheart, Moonveil. Ha 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 Okay, let's, let's, uh, let's, let's blow this popsicle stand. Cool, I got the moon veil. Well, I, let's actually take a look. Can I even equip this? Dex 18, intelligence of 23. Ooh. Okay. Hmm. I think I know how to how to resolve this. But first things first. You know what? I'll, I'll, I'll figure out what I'll do with Moonveil uh, at the start of the next episode. But for now, let's conclude by upgrading the Moonveil as much as I can. Alright. Moonveil. Got that. Two. Three. Four. Okay. So we got it to plus four. And let's go ahead and, uh... We're gonna stick with the... You know what? Let's go ahead and just stick with the Uji Katana for, for now. Primarily because the stat investment's a bit high. We'd have to sacrifice defense for offense. And I'm fine putting more upgrades into this... Until we're ready to use Moonveil more properly. So, let's go ahead and... Stick with the Uji Katana. Upgrade that. Oh, yes. And the, and the uh... So if you talk to Rogier and you get his, uh, you get Rogier's Rapier plus eight, 
you get access to his Ash of War Glint Blade, uh, the Glint Blade Phalanx Ash of War. So we'll go ahead and just apply this to the Uji Katana now. Yep, we're gonna go magic. Magic, baby. And for this, we're gonna go... Yeah, yeah, Barricade Shield. We still stick with Barricade Shield. But now we got Glint Blade Phalanx. And now my sword does magic damage. So yeah, this is a nice little uh, compromise, yeah. Yeah, I've got a magic katana. The Moon Veil will be my, my late game weapon, but we're still kind of low level. I like level 50, I'm not ready for Moon Veil yet. Because I still want to just dump more points into Vigor, Endurance, get those stats up. So yeah, uh, until the next time.